Today's episode of Show and Tell is going to be a little bit different. Before we get started, I encourage you to grab a piece of paper and something to write with because I am going to pose 15 questions to you and you'll have a short amount of time in which to come up with the answer. And at the end, we'll tally up how much you know about knitting. So as they say, let's get started. In this first image, is the knitter knitting English style or continental style? The correct answer is B, continental style. In this image, that's part of a dress from the Metropolitan Museum of Arts collection, I show you a sleeve. And question number two is, is the sleeve knitted in A, stockinette stitch, or B, garter stitch? And the correct answer is B, garter stitch. In this image, I'd like to know if this knitting is a three needle bind off, or knit in the round with DPNs. The correct answer is B, knit in the round with DPNs. Here I'm showing you a clear object that you would place over your knitting. Question number four, is this object a gauge ruler or a bud measure? And the correct answer is A, gauge ruler. In this example of color work, knit by yours truly, question number five is, does this represent A, stranded knitting, or B, intarsia? The correct answer is B, intarsia. In this specific type of stranded knitting known as Fair Isle, at most there can be this many colors per row. Is it A, 2, or B, 3? And the correct answer is 2. Fair Isle has at most two colors per row. In the motif seen here, question number seven is, is this pattern A, argyle, or B, tartan? And the correct answer is A, argyle. How are you doing so far? Are you getting them all right? Here's an example of some ribbing that I also knit. So question number eight is, is this ribbing A, multicolor ribbing, or B, corrugated ribbing? The correct answer is B, corrugated ribbing. This is a monogram that I put on one of my cardigans. Question nine, is the monogram done in A, duplicate stitch, or B, embroidery? The correct answer is A, duplicate stitch. In this lace cardigan that I knit, question number 10 asks, are the open work holes made by bird's eye stitch or yarn over? The correct answer is B, yarn over. This sample of knitting has a slightly different motif than stockinette or garter stitch gives us. Question 11 is, is it A, herringbone or B, zigzag? The correct answer is A, herringbone. 
In this image, we see a woman born in England, 1910, famous for her mathematical formula for constructing sweaters in the round. Question number 12, is she A, Barbara Walker, or B, Elizabeth Zimmerman? The correct answer is B, Elizabeth Zimmerman. These knit socks were excavated in Egypt at the end of the 19th century. Question number 13. Were they knit in A, 300 to 499 AD, or B, 300 to 499 BCE? The correct answer is A, 300 to 499 AD. This painting shows Mary knitting. Question number 14 asks, what is the name of the painting and the artist? Is it A, The Holy Family by Ambrosio Lorenzetti? Or is it B, Madonna Knitting by Bertram of Minden? The correct answer is A, The Holy Family by Ambrosio Lorenzetti, circa 1345. He was an Italian painter of the Sienese school, active from approximately 1317 to 1348. And for our last question, question number 15 asks, in the knitting shown here using a yarn made of chenille, you can see that some of the stitches have protruded from the flat surface of the knitting. Is that situation referred to as A, looping out, or B, worming out? The correct answer is B, worming out. So that wraps up this little quiz for today. Are you willing to share with us how many you got right? Comment below. I'll be back next week with my usual programming. If you liked this and you want to see more before then, feel free to check out this playlist of previous episodes that I've recorded. Take care.